15 people have drowned around picnic rocks in Marquette since 1963. Today, the National Weather Service held a Water Safety and Recreation Expo to teach beachgoers how to stay safe on the Great Lakes. TV6's Dustin Bonk gives us an up-close look at the expo. Safety first. The National Weather Service says that there are times when the Great Lakes are not safe and it's better to stay on shore. The expo gave lessons on water safety and educated the public on dangerous currents. Just having the knowledge of what conditions to avoid, what places to avoid while you're swimming is going to be great information to have and, and keep you safe. Unfortunately, once you get caught in that, it's very hard to get out. You can the NWS says Picnic Rocks is an important place to avoid because of its strong channel currents. Swimmers can be cited for going in this 24-7 no-swim zone. Lifeguards say to stay in the guarded areas within the buoys. There's no guarantee we'll get to you fast enough just because you're outside of our swim zone. That's why we have the buoys in place, to keep people in an area we can get to them with 100% certainty of getting to them on time. The current keeps pushing you out further into deeper water. Where you the NWS also warns of rip currents and high waves. Today, the water is calm, but along Marquette beaches, a breezy north wind can create hazardous swimming conditions. They recommend staying informed by reading their daily swim risk forecasts. Know before you go. Check the forecast before you leave for the beach in the morning. You're going to be able to see whether there's a high, low, or moderate risk for dangerous currents and high waves. Being informed about current lake conditions can make sure your beach visit doesn't keep you stuck in the sand. For links to more info, visit our website, UpperMichiganSource.com. In Marquette, Dustin Bonk, TV6 News.